I was recently asked the question of how many ways are there to worship? To which I answered infinitely. God has allowed us the opportunity to infinitely worship Him. We can worship any way we want to. As long as God is the object of our praise and of our worship, it doesn't matter. Now, I'm not saying go out and kill a cat and say that it's a burnt offering. I'm not saying that because I don't believe that brings glory to God. But if what you're doing brings glory to God and not yourself, the way that you worship does not matter. There are many, many ways to worship. It's infinitely how many ways you can worship. See, we have it in our minds that we worship by raising our hands and by shouting unto God. And that's good because that's honestly how some people worship. But some people worship sitting reverently. It doesn't matter how you worship. There is no one right way and one wrong way on how to worship. There isn't. No matter if you think that it's right or wrong to do it some way, it doesn't matter. I mean, I am a person who should have been born a Pentecostal because I will raise my hands. I will shout. I'm the loudest singer there is. But to say that I am worshiping and that someone that sits there and doesn't even get up isn't worshiping, that's wrong. Because to them, it could be worshiping. But to the person sitting there reverently and looking at the person yelling and, and screaming to say that he isn't worshiping, that he is doing nothing but being a wild hooligan, it's not right. Because in his image or in his own mind, he is worshiping God. Who are we to say? Who are we to even dare say that someone is not worshiping God or cannot worship God the way that they're worshiping. What right do we have to say that when you raise your hands and scream and out loud and with that you are acting like a wild hooligan and you need to calm down because we don't worship that way here. What right are we to say when someone's sitting just reverently as they can, what right are we to say you need to get up because we worship God as if we yell. We are, have no right to say and uh, to tell someone else that they can't worship the way that they're worshiping. But, but, the object of our worship must be Yahweh, Jehovah, God, the Father of the Son, Jesus Christ. It must be God. Because if we are worshiping any other way to any other God, then you're not worshiping. You're worshiping something else. And that we can say something against. But if you and I are worshiping the same God in two different ways, that is okay. We have no right to tell each other that we should worship differently. No right. So I know that these blogs are usually happy-go-lucky, but this, we just need to know that we have no right to tell someone else that they can't worship the way that they believe and the way they feel that they need to worship. As long as they're worshiping the one true God, we have no right because there is no number one way to worship God. We can worship infinitely.